Well, folks, we have we have gone around the walls and we're back almost to the end of our journey. As you can see, this is Desert Storm and uh, what was it, about 1991. This is the war that my husband, Harold Atwell, served in. He was in the Army Reserve for I don't know how many years. And uh, I'm running out of juice here on my camera, I think. Uh, I've got some left, but I'm going to just shot, uh, shoot some of these pictures here, and then I'm going to turn it over to the pro in a minute. Uh, I'll tell you one thing. I, all of this looks so familiar, these uniforms right here. Uh, many a time, uh, my husband has gone off to summer camp, what we called it. Uh, I think... I'm not speaking out of line to say they were a training unit, uh, and he left uh, his job and his family and to serve the country and uh, do whatever they had to do. That he did go to Desert Storm, but thank goodness that war didn't last a long time. And uh, talk to me, tell me some things. Wait. I'll tell you what's fascinating to me about this particular display. You see the pilot on the end? That's a, Mar that's a Marine Corps helicopter pilot. Yes. I got that from a major named Scott Stebbins. Now, what's interesting about that to me is that during World War II, Scott's daddy was a Marine enlisted pilot, and downstairs I have his uniform oh, on display. Oh, my goodness. Now, so we have, a, we have two generations worth of Marine pilots. One for World War II, one for Desert Storm. Yeah. That's wonderful. And that fascinated me, you know. That is um, that's wonderful. Mm -hmm. Well, thank you for so, showing us so much uh, of all this. Now, that uh, that looks familiar to me. I remember uh, Harold talking about this. It's the gas mask, gas isn't it? Mask, and right. uh, I remember them talking about training with that, that I believe. Uh, Look at the boots. Those are sand boots. What, what, what were those? Well, those what are just those are just combat boots. Co combat boots. Combat boots. And were they, they were, they were well, made for the the desert, you know. Yeah. Well, at least evidence, folks, that I couldn't train anybody on all this stuff. I'm glad <laughs> your job, but not mine. We'll be back in a minute.